Hi, welcome to the yoga of weeding or how to combine your yoga practice with your weeding practice. So there are a lot of alternatives to this time not honored position for pulling weeds. This is gonna wear your back out. It disadvantages the core and you'll notice it in your weeding. One clue that you don't have your core fully engaged is when you go to pull something and you don't come up with roots. Really important as a gardener, you wanna get the roots. So first of all, pull close to yourself. Now, this has a couple of advantages. When you lift, elevator drawstring zipper, you get the root almost every time. It's also easier to use your fingers, almost like a little, uh, I don't even know what that's called, uh, a version of a hoe that allows you to get around the root and pull it. And when that doesn't work for you, leave it out, come back with boiling water later, pour it on that and it will come back. The other thing that this really helps to remind you is to change your position frequently. So I've started in sort of a seated forward fold. I could have extended my legs and brought my thigh up to brace my torso. And when I start getting too far away from myself, I shift forward. It's a pretty easy shift into a squat. Now, maybe your knees don't do this. So there are options. And then, so I'll just show you the next option, which is a tabletop position. Here, it is important that you keep the core braced. Elevator drawstring, zipper. Remember the zipper isn't doing that. We're lightly engaging the muscles on the gut side of the spine, and then the outer abdominal muscles will come along with it. Now from here, with my core lightly engaged, mm, this one's gonna be a, a bear. It is much more likely that even when I need a bear, let's see if this is gonna work. I'm able to pull him up by the roots or her. I have no idea. So you're on your knees. It's kind of pokey, right? Pretty easy to next. And if you need more leverage, come to your lunge. This is a low lunge that you might remember from yin or hatha. And then you can walk it forward. You can do that with sort of a crow walk. This was the original crow walk. It's good for your digestion, your pelvic floor health, and for mobilizing around your garden while you're weeding. So then I would just sweep the next knee down and I'm over here. So as you can see, changing position frequently. This both helps me motivate around the garden without getting up, down, up, down, up, down, which is also really great for not overstretching or overusing any particular set of muscles. Now, so, Maybe your knees are happier with something like this. Just make sure you're not pulling too far in front of the shoulder. And come all the way back to directly underneath. And then I like my handy dandy log. 
sure if you're taking a sort of seated forward fold or staff pose position, your hips are elevated and you're not just doing it on the ground. Most folks will round through the low back if they sit directly on the ground and their hips and knees are on the same level. The other thing is the ground isn't likely to be level in and of itself. So it's likely that your hips could be, see I'm not pulling close enough to myself. There we go. It's likely that your hips and knees are offset from one another enough to actually encourage the rounding through the low back. From here, you can convert to a comfortable cross-legged seat with a little minimal forward fold. Elevator drawstring zipper. And remember, well, even without the cord, that one came up, but it was loose. But if you're not coming up with roots and you know that you've gone under the crown of the root, it's a, it's a clue that that's a reminder. Elevator drawstring zipper. Finally, regardless of which of these positions you choose and how frequently you choose to change, Engage the cobra muscles, particularly these side muscles that originate on the outside of your scapula. You could think of like doing the cobra and then activate those muscles and you're integrating your arm with your core strength. Your whole body is gonna get a more even workout actually light workout but it's a good workout with your weeding and you're get you're gonna be happier and healthier for it and so will your garden. May all of your days be yoga days and may this be a happy yoga day.